Are you proud to be a Jew today? I'm proud to be a Jew today. There are so many amazing things happening right now in this country, and I couldn't be more grateful to be a part of it. I feel terrible for my family, for my friends, for my colleagues who do not live in the state of Israel because they are living in a state of terror. That's not a comment on any specific country or city, London, Toronto, Melbourne, wherever it might be. Rather, it's because people who are not living here in Israel at this exact moment are getting their news from news sources that are only saying terrible, tragic things. And when you're here on the ground, when you stand with Israel by standing in Israel, you get to see the achdos, the avas Yisrael, the love between the Jewish people for one another. People with big kippahs, with little kippahs, with baseball hats, with no hats, people with tattoos on their heads. Everybody is on the same team right now. We're all on God's team. And right now, I couldn't be more grateful to be here. For those who say that we're not the indigenous people here, I'd encourage them to check their history books. But I'd also like to share one of my favorite stories. During the 1967 Six-Day War, the soldiers who went into the city of Hebron and conquered the Cave of the Patriarchs, the burial place of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, as they conquered this place, when the war reached a lull, they lay down and rested within the cave of the patriarchs. And as they were resting there, the local sheikh came by and said to them, What are you doing here? This is a holy place. This is not appropriate behavior to lie down on the ground of a holy place. The Arab sheikh said that. And Rav Mordechai Eliyahu Zetzal, the chief Sephardic rabbi who was there congratulating the soldiers on their heroism, said to the sheikh in Arabic, it's inappropriate for the servants, the sons of the servants, to lie down in the king's palace. It's inappropriate behavior for them. It's not respectful. But in the king's palace, the prince can act however he wants because he's the king's son. It is so good to be in the Jewish homeland, in the land that God has given to us and to appreciate what a gift it is and what a gift it is to be with each other during this amazing time where I've never seen such love, one person to another person. Neighbors who don't know each other at all are now the best of friends. I couldn't be more inspired to be here.